We have rain across eastern parts of the UP, but snow across central and western sections where visibility is also being reduced and we have slippery roadways. As we take a broader look at the storm system, the center of the storm system is down near Kansas City and there's a warm front that extends east of the center of the storm system. Now we're never really going to see this warm front crossing through our area, so we're, uh, the cold temperatures are going to remain across the UP and ahead of this warm front is where we're seeing all of this uh, precipitation taking place with rain across lower Michigan, snow across parts of the UP, and the warm temperatures located south of the warm front. So looking at temperatures across the Midwest, we are experiencing temperatures mainly in the 30s across the UP. It's 32 degrees at Sawyer Airport, 43 in Green Bay. It's 70 degrees in Chicago, 85 degrees in St. Louis with all of this warm air located south of the warm front. The issue again is that that warm front will never cross through the UP, so we're going to remain into some cold temperatures over the next several days. For tomorrow, morning rain, but that's going to change to scattered snow showers late in the day. On Saturday, cold early, but a dry start to the weekend, and then we'll have some more snow showers moving into our area Sunday afternoon and Sunday evening. Blue indicating the snow, purple indicating the potential of rain-snow mix, also the possibility of sleep Leap. Green and yellow indicating plain rainfall across the eastern UP staying as rain. For most of us, we'll probably see a changeover to rain showers heading into the early morning hours of Friday. Still could be some snow over the higher elevations in western parts of the UP. And then as temperatures drop late in the day on Friday, we still could have a few lingering snow showers, but all of this is going to move up towards the northeast. And then on Saturday, most of us are going to have dry conditions to start the weekend. There could be some scattered flurries over parts of the Keweenaw Peninsula and the potential for a band of some lake effect snow showers affecting eastern parts of the UP. For tonight, a wintry mess over western parts of the UP, rain by the Lake Michigan shoreline, Temperatures tonight around 36 degrees in Marquette, 33 degrees in Iron Mountain, near 40 degrees by the Lake Michigan shoreline. For tomorrow, these high temperatures will mainly be in the morning, 38 degrees in Marquette, 39 in Houghton, and 43 in Escanaba. Temperatures are going to remain well below normal over the next several days with highs in the upper 30s for Friday and Saturday, middle 30s on Sunday, middle to upper 30s on Monday. Day, so almost a flat line here on our daily temperature trend. Notice that the normal is 49 degrees and we're going to be nowhere near that over the next several days. For tomorrow, some morning rain, still a chance of showers in the afternoon with temperatures then going to be in the upper 30s and then near 30 in the evening with a transition over to some scattered flurries. On Saturday, mostly cloudy, a cold morning starting off in the 20s while highs only reaching 37 degrees. On Sunday, a cloudy but probably dry in the morning with temperatures in the 20s, some snow showers moving in for Sunday afternoon and evening with high temperatures near 35 degrees. We'll have a chance of scattered flurries early Monday. We could see a couple peaks of sunshine in the afternoon with highs only reaching 36 degrees and then very cold on Tuesday with morning temperatures starting off around 20 degrees, a mix of sun and clouds. Highs for Tuesday only reaching the lower to middle 30s in the afternoon.